Hello guys, today we're going to take a look at the episode No Escape. It aired on March 30th, 1979, it's about 48 minutes long. It, it has a 7.1 out of 10 on IMDb with about 100 issues or votes. It guest stars James Wainwright, who was in the movie The Survivors, and it's directed by Jeffrey Hayden, who directed episodes of Manix. So, in this episode, David escapes a place with, or... I don't think he escapes, but but he's on the run as usual, and this time he's accompanied by a guy who has some mental issues, like big ones, and he gets these delusions of being like some author, and he becomes incredibly dangerous. It's actually kind of intriguing. I always take, I always try to get, I always, it's always easier to get into the episodes when the villain kind of is a little comic booky. Because it makes it feel more like an even match between the Hulk and the other character, even though the other character 99 percent of the time can't outstrength the Hulk. There's not a lot of examples of that. There's one big one that we'll take a look at in the future, but this one here, it's just it, the the and it, a lot of the episodes talk about like psychiatric help, you know, and all that kind of thing. It's it's definitely an episode where they highlight like people with with uh, diseases and need help and I will say this the guy who plays the mentally disturbed guy is pretty pr very good at it because because he he's very intense you don't really know what's gonna set him off you're just kind of sitting there waiting for him to just lose his shit and just hurt somebody it's pretty good um Hulk action pretty decent pretty solid um I will say this I don't I don't, I, I might just, it's hard to describe this episode as a higher up episode, mainly because they could have gone farther. I kind of would have liked to see if, see more done. And that's kind of the thing with some of these Hulk episodes where you're just like, man, that was kind of an interesting idea. They could have done a bit more. As it is, it's fine, but they could have done more. I think this is one of those. But as it is, it's fine. It, it kind of, it's, it's just another, like, you know, Hulk topic, and another, some good Hulk action, good, decent writing, great acting, that's kind of the typical norm of the series, there's, there's, they highlight some cool things, but overall, it's another decent episode, but yeah, that's all I have to say about it, it's a decent episode, go ahead and give it a watch, it's, it's pretty solid, and yeah, um, that's all I have to say about it, it's, pretty decent. <laughs> but yeah, guys, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, please subscribe and like the videos, and have a good day.